Question 10. Consider two events, A and B, defined in the same sample space. And in part A it says, show that the probability of A or B is equal to the probability of A plus the probability of not A uh, and B. So this is a union and intersection. This is a bit of a strange question, this one, because I, I feel it can be answered very easily on a Venn diagram, but uh, the mark schemes do have some, uh, some working out here. So I'm going to do a very similar method to method one. The probability of A union B or B, we know that this is typically the combined events formula, probability of A plus the probability of B minus the intersection A and B. And, and Venn diagram wise, that, that makes sense. We have A, B, all of A plus all of B, but we have the middle counted twice, so we minus away the middle. Now, we want to make this equal to this, so I'm going to write this as the probability of A, and then I'm going to write the probability of B as A and B. Just bear with me here. The probability of A and B. And then this is just to encapsulate B, plus the probability of not A and B. So not A and B. And then I'm still going to minus away the probability of A and B. Now what I've done there is I've, I've got my event A and then A and B, so I've counted this now twice, and then the probability of not A and B is just B, and I'm going to minus away that bit that I counted twice. So the reason why I've done that is if we realise that this is the same as that, but this is negative, we're going to be left with the probability of A plus the probability of not A and B, which is what they asked us to prove. So this is valid, and I think just quickly a Venn diagram would make sense of that because the probability of A or B is all of the circle shaded. The probability of A would, would have all of this. The probability of not A and B would just be the B bit. Okay, that's the answer to part A.